Hello everybody. How you guys doing? Uh, these are my glasses. I need readers to look into the hives. Anyway, uh, I figured I'd I figured I'd give you guys a little video on uh, on my my pump assembly for my bees. So I'm out here. I'm at a yard. I've only got a dozen hives out here. I've taken most of them uh, to a warmer climate about three four hours away but I still have some that are here local and this is a dozen of them right here matter of fact I gotta bring a few more over here um, but uh, I wanted to show you guys uh, I have down south I have uh, 73 hives I had 75 but I had to yank a couple so anyway uh, I have 73 hives down there and I know you guys know what it's like to have to take a jug and fill your feeders or to go and uh, go to your jars and fill your jars up or to pop the lid off the jar and then fill them up with uh, fill them up with syrup and you know, it's just such a pain in the neck. So I wanted to show you guys what I got going on and uh, and uh, kind of walk you through it okay so anyway so what we have is uh, not everybody i mean you can get these ibc totes for cheap man i mean even if you got to buy one new they're like 250 300 bucks which is really not much but most places you can find them for like 60 70 bucks used and that's food grade you know so i get mine uh uh, used and I get them for free but uh, that's not going to be the case for everybody so anyway so but what we have here is what I did I had some of this stuff uh, laying around so that's why I used it but this is a cam lock coupling you want to use a cam lock coupling uh, whether it's a two inch or you drop it down to an inch or inch and a half or whatever you want to use and this is a two inch coupler just a regular pipe coupling um, and that threads on to this valve let me turn this valve well I'll show you how, how it feeds see that little leak down there I've had this thing open for about 45 minutes because I was going through the hives and then it took me another five minutes to feed them <laughs> I mean it's, it's it's literally that fast if you got the room and you got the hose, it's super quick. So anyway, so we got a two inch coupler going to a, a two inch uh, male cam lock fitting to a two inch female cam lock fitting, which is attached to this hose. Okay, and that's a barb fitting into there. And then we got a two inch coupler, two inch cam lock uh, fitting here. That's the male end. This is the female end. Then this is a reducer down to one inch, uh, down to a one inch uh, threaded pipe fitting, okay, which is the entrance, the feed to, to the pump. This pump I got at Harbor Freight for like a, let's say 175 bucks. So far, these fittings and the pump probably right around $200. Okay, then you go from there, this is the discharge side or the outlet side of the pump goes through it's a one inch right out to three quarter inch hose so you're gonna have to get a pipe fitting to hose fitting all right so that's that's that guy right there so it goes from regular pipe fitting to the uh, the the it goes from three quarter inch to uh, three quarter inch three three quarter inch pipe to three quarter inch hose fitting right goes to this hose and that goes to a hose reel, which I got. I got the cheapy at Harbor or at uh, Home Depot, uh, just because uh, I didn't want to spend. I mean, later on, I plan on spending the money, getting a nice one, a couple hundred bucks, right? But I don't have a couple hundred bucks just laying around, right? So I figured I'd go with this. Oh, and that's the leak from it. Like I said, forty-five minutes. 
it, it leaks just a little bit, right? But the bees are gonna take care of that, no problem anyway. So you got your hose reel. Hose reel was like 30 bucks. The hose was, uh, you wanna get a heavy duty hose, right? You wanna get the commercial grade or, or just a really good hose. So that was like 70, 60 bucks. You could probably find them on, on sale. And this is a hundred foot hose. So, I mean, uh, pay attention when you uh, get your reel too, because this, this reel said it had like a 200 foot capacity. Well, this is a hundred foot hose and it barely fits on here. Their 200 foot capacity is for a half inch hose or something like that, something small. So, or five eighths hose. This is a three quarter inch hose. So, and that's what you're gonna wanna run. Another reason why you wanna have a heavy duty hose, that pump builds up more pressure than you think. That little pump can build up some pressure. So when you open the valve and close the valve, I'm telling you, whoa, builds up a little bit of pressure. Even though it's not a PD, uh, positive displacement pump, it's a little centrifugal pump, I believe. I, believe. Uh, I think that uh, it still builds up some pretty good pressure. All right, so now we need an adapter from your three quarter inch hose to back to pipe fitting. This is just a quarter turn uh, plastic valve. So this guy right here is about five bucks. This guy right here and that other brass one. Everything else is pretty cheap. I think this was like two and a half bucks. This little fitting right here was like a dollar and that's like 50 cents or something like that. So this is a three quarter inch hose adapted to this is the adapter adapted to three quarter inch uh, pipe and then this has a 90 a pipe 90 and then a pipe nipple very important make sure you get the nipple okay you don't want to have uh, just coming out like straight out okay you want to get something that you can direct it anyway so I mean I probably have 300 and some odd dollars into this thing right but I'm telling you it takes me to feed uh, me and my brother we fed a hundred no 225 hives uh, the other day it took us about an hour maybe an hour and a half nah, not even that long. probably an hour hour to feed 225 hives that was me and him hustling pretty good. You know, we were trying to get out of there. But it took us an hour <laughs> with this assembly. So I want to show you real quick. Let me get some new gloves on and I'm going to show you real quick. Because uh, how fast it fills these things up. All right, hold on. Just give us a second. Not only that, but whenever you... Like this hive that I'm gonna, I'm about to feed right now. It's kind of a nasty hive, and uh, the last thing you want to do is be hanging around, getting stung by these bees, right? So I use these Harbor Freight uh, seven mil nitro gloves. Bees very rarely, if ever. I mean, I've been stung like three times through these gloves. That's it. So there are the uh, these guys right here. No big deal, you know. I think they're ten dollars. But of course, if you get the twenty percent off coupon or you, you know do do whatever you want to do, uh, it'll be a lot cheaper. So let's see here. Uh, I think this one's got one in the top. Yep. So what we'll do. Crank this guy on and I'll just show you real quick how little time it takes to fill this guy up. Let's see if I can. I wonder if you can. Yeah, that should be fine. Hopefully it doesn't fall down. But if it does, I'll, I'll yell and let you know. We're going to try and do this single-handed, so it's going to take a little longer, but you'll see what I'm talking about. All right, so we already got the lid propped open, right?
right? We pull the hose over. Here's the hose. Pop it in the side that's on the high side. Take a look down in there. I have a gallon and a half feeders inside. I don't have this guy all the way open because I'm doing it single-handed. Alright. That's it. See? Look at these fussy bees. These guys are fussy. Anyway, that's it. That's all it takes to fill this guy up. Slide it over. Done. Anyway, I don't know how long that took. Maybe 20 seconds. Maybe 20 seconds to fill that thing up. And if it was had both my hands, I had both my hands and, uh, oh, my wife's trying to call me. If I had both my hands and I was uh, just jamming along, had everything open, wasn't really paying attention to how to record and everything, I'd probably get it done even faster than that because I'd have that thing wide open and it'd be good to go. So anyway, quick video, well, kind of long video, but uh, good information. All right, guys, we'll see you and God bless.